In the ever-dynamic financial arena, all eyes are fixated on Palantir Technologies, a software titan specializing in big data analytics and integration. This trailblazer in the realm of artificial intelligence has captured the market's fascination, rapidly emerging as a pivotal government defense supplier amidst heightened geopolitical tensions worldwide. Palantir stands triumphant, etching its name in history, while consistently demonstrating impressive year-over-year -year growth in both its top and bottom line results. With an iron grip on expense management and minimal debt burdens, the company finds itself poised for future expansion on a grand scale. Furthermore, its early stage penetration of end markets, particularly the lucrative commercial segment, combined with the groundbreaking introduction of its artificial intelligence platform, or AIP, presents a compelling proposition for growth stock enthusiasts. While Palantir commands a premium valuation, compared to the broader market mirroring its high-growth counterparts, historical precedents suggest the tantalizing potential for substantial share price appreciation as profitability becomes more pronounced. Undeniably, this Silicon Valley titan boasts a stable financial foundation, a growth trajectory that inspires confidence, and a valuation that can sustainably reflect its vast potential over time. The stock's performance over the past 12 months has been nothing short of stellar, soaring over 100% and captivating investors. As 2024 unfolds, gains have surpassed the 30% mark. This meteoric rally is largely fueled by Wall Street's anticipation that the company will double its profits over the next several years, solidifying its position as a formidable force in the tech sphere. However, the stock's ascent experienced a significant pause following the company's quarter one results, disappointing the market despite delivering an earnings beat and an upward revision to its guidance. This unexpected turn of events has sent ripples throughout the financial sector, prompting analysts and investors alike to closely examine the underlying factors behind this temporary setback. In this comprehensive analysis, we delve into the compelling reasons why Palantir shares should continue their rally, and how the recent pullback could present an opportune moment for investors to seize the dip, capitalizing on the company's long-term growth potential. Palantir's quarter one earnings were far from dismal, defying initial market expectations. However, the results ultimately left investors disappointed, triggering a 15% plunge in share value over the subsequent trading days, a reaction that has puzzled industry experts. The big data titan reported earnings of $0.08 cents per share, surpassing market estimates by a comfortable margin, while revenue clocked in at an impressive $634 million, indicating a robust 21% growth compared to the same quarter last year. Within the United States alone, the company generated a staggering $150 million in revenue from the commercial segment, marking an impressive 24% annual increase. Furthermore, Palantir's guidance suggested the regional market should make maintain its dominant position and emerge as one of the primary growth drivers in the short term, providing a glimmer of hope for investors. However, the primary factor that contributed to Palantir's shares plummeting was the company's reported expenses, totaling an eye-watering $437.20 million, representing a 5% annual increase. The most concerning aspect, however, was a statement from Chief Executive Officer Alex Karp regarding future expectations of increased expenses. He elaborated, while we expect the expenses to ramp starting in quarter two through the back half of the year, we remain focused on calibrating expense growth below revenue growth for the full year in order to continue delivering on our goals of sustained profitability and operating income. For clarification, when Palantir stated that it expects expenses to start ramping up in the second quarter and continue throughout the year, this logically implies that each subsequent quarter will witness an increase in this number. Naturally, this revelation stoked apprehension among investors, as Carp indicated that spending would escalate at a higher rate throughout the year, potentially impacting the company's profitability targets. Palantir's business is experiencing significant demand for its cutting-edge services, prompting substantial investments in hiring additional talent and consequently leading to increased expenses. However, I believe investors were implicitly factoring in the potential for sustained growth results with the company's existing capacity and current staff, which would not be feasible to maintain cost stability over an extended period. This sense of disappointment stemmed from the expectation that revenue would continue its upward trajectory while costs remained stable, thereby expanding profit margins and delivering greater returns to shareholders. Consequently, I believe this sentiment was a major contributing factor to the decline in the stock price following the earnings report. 
in a bid to alleviate investor concerns and provide clarity on its direction for the year ahead, Palantir recently revised its 2024 revenue guidance, projecting an impressive $2.68 billion at the midpoint. Furthermore, the company disclosed that operating income is expected to range between an impressive $868 million and $880 million. It emphasized that this upgrade also applies to operations income, reiterating the free cash flow projection at a remarkable $900 million at the midpoint. Moreover, the company confidently anticipates profitability in every quarter of 2024, signaling an ambitious yet achievable outlook for the year ahead. Analyst consensus forecasts paint an optimistic picture for Palantir with projections showing the company ending 2024 with an earnings per share estimate of 33 cents. This implies a price earnings ratio of 62, which is a staggering 230% above the industry average. However, considering its growth prospects, primarily centered around its revolutionary AIP, the company trades at a forward price earnings growth ratio of 1.37, factoring in earnings per share long term growth consensus estimates. A a figure nearly 30% below the application software industry average, indicating potential for further upside. Another noteworthy aspect that has garnered attention from industry analysts is Palantir's significant dilution of its shares over the last three years, amounting to approximately 2.34 billion shares. This strategic move was prompted by the company's substantial share price surge in 2021 and the necessity to raise capital to fuel its ambitious growth plans, reduce debt burdens, and enhance liquidity reserves. In addition to navigating a more challenging macroeconomic environment in recent years, I believe the dilution of the company's equity has also contributed to shaking investor confidence and impacting Palantir's share price performance in the short term. As the first quarter of 2024 drew to a close, Palantir boasted a robust $3.90 billion in cash and equivalents, providing a strong position to execute strategic share buybacks. During the earnings call, the company announced it had repurchased roughly 500,000 shares as part of its share repurchase program, signaling its commitment to enhancing shareholder value. As of the end of the quarter, Palantir had approximately 990 million shares remaining from the total original authorization, leaving ample room for further buybacks in the future. This share repurchase activity implies a reduction in the number of shares outstanding, typically resulting in more ownership of the company's stock concentrated among existing shareholders. This strategic move potentially leads to increased earnings per share and greater control over decision-making for those shareholders, further aligning their interests with the company's long-term growth objectives. I believe Palantir stands as one of the most promising companies poised to ride the artificial intelligence boom smoothly, leveraging its cutting-edge technologies and visionary leadership. Its groundbreaking artificial intelligence platform has gained significant traction through a series of highly successful demo workshops, resulting in substantial revenue growth that has surpassed the $1 billion mark over the last 12 months. The resounding success of these AIP workshops indicates their potential to further drive adoption and revenue growth, cementing Palantir's position as a leader in this rapidly evolving space. The recent downturn in the share price rally following the earnings report appears, in my view, as a slightly exaggerated perception on the part of the market. While there is a notion that the company could achieve even more by better balancing expenses, this may not be entirely realistic given the company's aggressive growth trajectory and the need to invest in talent and resources. However, I anticipate the expected surge in revenue demand, coupled with the strategic share repurchase program, should offset the projected increase in expenses in short order. I firmly believe this turnaround around is imminent, and with it, Palantir will resume generating attractive returns for its investors, solidifying its position as a force to be reckoned with in the tech industry.